Hello guys, today I'm again back with another new drug approved by FDA in 2020 and this is a drug called as Ocelodrostat and Ocelodrostat guys is a drug which acts by inhibiting 11 beta hydroxylase an enzyme that is required for steroid synthesis so it is a steroid synthesis inhibitor and obviously you could have guessed the use by now that it is approved for treatment of Cushing's disease right and in which cases guys in patients where you cannot do surgery pituitary surgery cannot be done or in case you have done the surgery but the patient is not responding so it isn't curative even after surgery right now how does this drug act guys this is here in this diagram you can see this is oscillodrostat which acts by inhibiting your 11 beta hydroxylase in the same pathway cholesterol synthesis can be inhibited by you can see your ketoconazole it blocks synthesis of cholesterol so they both act upon uh, steroid synthesis but oscillodrostat is a direct inhibitor of st steroid synthesis whereas Ketoconazole is an indirect inhibitor of steroid synthesis. How? By depleting cholesterol, we cannot synthesize steroid. So both these drugs, ketoconazole as well as oscillodrostat, can be used in Cushing's disease. It is a new drug which is which has lesser side effect as compared to ketoconazole. Right. Nevertheless, guys, let us have a look at other aspects of this drug. Route of administration is oral, and by oral route, the starting dose is two two milligrams BD gas twice a day, and then after every two weeks, after every two weeks. You need to re-evaluate the patient plasma cortisol level symptoms and based upon that you can keep on increasing or titrate the dose right side effects guys obviously inhibits steroid synthesis so there could be adrenal insufficiency plus other side effects like edema nausea headache can also be seen with this drug so this is guys what we have to discuss today a new drug which blocks steroid synthesis oscillodrostat that is used for treatment of Cushing's disease guys so I'll keep on posting these new updates guys from time to time and so that you get notified on time please do not forget to subscribe to my channel by clicking on this link guys till then bye bye see you take care